Hi everyone, welcome to our first video for DIY After Dark. And for this month's activity for just for grown-ups, we're going to be making a clothespin trivet. So for this activity, you need about 24 clothespins like this. You need some glue. I personally recommend hot glue. It works really well, really fast, but you can also use Elmer's glue. And when you come pick up your kit at the library, it will be Elmer's glue and some kind of acrylic paint or stain. You could also leave it natural. Um, you'll see mine in just a moment. So with these 24 clothespins, I only have two right now because I already made one. The first thing you have to do is take them apart. So you want to take the metal pieces off of the clothespins and you can just discard them. You're not gonna use them at all for this, this craft. Take the two pieces and you're gonna put them back to back like that. You can go ahead and glue it. Now Elmer's, of course, it will work. It takes forever to dry. So if you're going to do this with Elmer's glue, like I said, it will work, it'll just take a while. You can see it's very movable right there because it's not the strongest glue. You could also use wood glue, super glue, whatever kind of glue you have. Like I said, kits we're giving out at the library will have Elmer's, but it works, just takes a little bit longer. So once you have all 24 of these broken apart and then put together like this, I think it kind of looks like a little person, head, body, legs. You take them like so, and you're gonna put them together like this. I'm not gonna glue them because these are all wet here, but you just wanna make sure they're all lined up nice, nicely. And you're gonna go the whole way, way around with them. A tip that I found is I did mine standing up really quickly. Take your time with it. Sit down, work on a, a flat surface, and line them all up. So I had to re-glue mine because I said I did mine very quickly, but this is what it will look like when it's done. See, my glue hasn't set yet here. I've been using mine actually to hold my flowers on and I haven't gotten a chance to paint it yet because I haven't decided what color I wanted to use yet. But that is how you make a clothespin trivet. It's really easy. If you use hot glue, it won't take you very long at all or any kind of stronger, quick drying glue. Um, if you use the Elmer's, prepare for it to maybe take a, a day or two so everything is nice and firm. And then of course, once it's all together, you can go ahead and paint it or stain it, whatever color you like. Hope you enjoy this craft. Let us know um, how you liked it and send us pictures. Bye.